Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to sell SafeMoon token and then convert it back over to BNB and then send it back over to your Binance so you guys can then convert it into USDT or whatever other tender that you guys are looking to convert it to. And then, of course, if you guys want to uh, put it into your bank accounts after that, it is quite easy to do. Uh, so all you guys have to do right away is go over to your trust wallet and open it up. And what we're going to have to do here that is different than purchasing the SafeMoon is we don't have to worry about adding any of the contract IDs or anything like that as they'll already be in your trust wallet because you already own SafeMoon. So you guys don't have to worry about any of that kind of stuff. Uh, but to sell SafeMoon now, you just want to go over to your browser and you want to go down and go over to PancakeSwap just like you guys did to purchase it. And then uh, just make sure your wallet's still connected. It should already be connected as you already purchased SafeMoon. Uh, but once you guys have it connected there, you want to go ahead to where it says the from token right here in the exchange. Click on BNB or whatever token it says there and just type in SafeMoon. Once you guys find SafeMoon here, you can go ahead and click on SafeMoon. And just click on I understand and continue. Once you guys do that there, you can then switch to your second currency, which will be BNB to convert into. You guys can convert it into a different one if you want. I always convert into the BNB smart chain just because I can transfer it over to Binance. Um, but once you guys put your two uh, coins in there, you can go ahead and decide how much safe moon that you guys want to sell. I'm obviously not going to sell any of my safe moon right now, uh, but if you guys are looking to sell safe moon, you can go ahead and type in the amount that you guys want to sell. And then it will show you the amount of BNB that you're going to get in exchange. Once you guys have done that, you just want to make sure your slippage tolerance is on 12% for safe moon. So you just go to where those three lines are, click on that and switch it to 12%. Once you guys do that, you'll be able to sell your safe moon. All you have to do now is click on where it says insufficient safe moon balance. Click on that and it'll show you a more broken down version of your transaction and your fees and things like that. Now, if you're okay with those fees and things that you see in the next page, you can go ahead and click on confirm and this BNB will then go into your wallet on your trust wallet. Now, what you guys will have to do if you want to transfer your BNB over to say Binance so you guys can trade it into different currencies or withdraw it into your bank accounts. All you guys have to do is click on your smart chain wallet. So you just got to find your smart chain wallet, click on smart chain and click on send. And then all you guys have to do is get a address for your BNB to go over to. So what you guys will do is head over to say Binance or another exchange that will accept smart chain. So we'll go into Binance right now. And now we're just going to go over to where our wallet is and we're just going to look for BNB. Once we find BNB here, we can go ahead and click on deposit and then continue. And it's just going to let us know here that we have to send it on the same network. So we're going to go over to the BEP20 network, the Binance Smart Chain. It is very, very important that you guys click on that BEP20 network, so make sure you don't miss that step. You can go ahead and click on the copy option for the BNB deposit address. Click on that and exit back over to your Trust Wallet. And then what you guys want to do is paste your address right there. And then type in the amount of BNB that you want to transfer over. Now, if you just sold your safe moon and you want to transfer all the BNB over, you can just click on max and it'll put the max amount of BNB that you can send back over. So let's just say if it was two, for example, we can click on done and then click on next. And it's just going to ask us here to confirm. If you guys are okay with everything that you see right here, you can go ahead and click up confirm. It's going to tell me to top up my smart chain because I don't have the, the actual BNB in there right now. But if you guys actually did sell your safe moon, you will. So you can ignore that and just send it over to that address. Now, once it is over to that address, you will then have your BNB back in your Binance, and then you'll be able to convert that over to, say, USDT or deposit into your bank account. So it is very, very easy to do. Anyhow, if you guys need more help showing how to deposit into your bank account, just let me know. I'll be happy to make another video. But that is exactly how you sell SafeMoon back into BNB and get your funds secured. Anyhow, I really hope I was able to help you guys out with this tutorial. If this video did help you out, be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching.